guys yeah right finally it's me again nikki i know i haven't posted new videos for a long time but you can't blame me there are new covid cases everywhere in china so my trips planned trips are canceled a day or two days before i depart <sighs> but anyway here i am in du jiang yan if you don't know where du jiang yan is Watch my last video. The thing is, I expressed so much of my love for Chengdu, but I still haven't even made one single video about my favorite part. That's why I'm here. I'm going inside this small alley to eat at this bug restaurant that my friend recommends. What the hell, bug restaurant? I'm not gonna eat bug, but yeah, it's bug restaurant. Bug restaurants usually refers to the small restaurants, the greasy ones on the streets or inside the residential neighborhoods like this one. <gasps> this freaking place is sealed off. <gasps> oh shit, it's closed. Closed? Not open? No problem. I guess we can find another one because bug restaurants are everywhere in Chengdu. And guess what? I saw a pretty good one on the way there. And you know why I know it's good? Because that place was full of aunties eating inside. Local aunties. I think I found a perfect place. The guy sitting at the next table is laughing at me, like I'm eating so much all by myself. <laughs> so let me show you. Of course I have to get my favorite, which is too famous to ignore and too delicious not to share. Twice cooked pork belly. And some leafy veggies you won't eat. And the signature dish, braised pork intestine. And lastly, the must-eat tofu rice. Oh my god, just look at it. It looks more organic than the soy milk at Whole Foods. You just dip it in a special aromatic hot sauce and eat it with white rice. Ooh, the texture is firmer than regular tofu and you can pick it up easily with chopsticks. The braised pork intestine. Gosh, it's so rich in flavor. Mm. It tastes tender and fat but not greasy. And trust me, it has no weird smell. I mean, if I was gonna feed you this intestine, you couldn't tell what this is at all, but you're gonna love it. I'm eating a portion of two people. And why don't you take a guess? How much all these foods are going to cost me today? Well, if I could only order one dish, this is the one to go. First, fry the pork belly in the lump oil to quickly cook it and then drain the excessive oil and return the meat back to the wok to stir-fry again. Woo! MSG added! And some other sauce to season it. And trust me, you're not gonna get the same flavor if you try to cook this at home because your gas stove is not gonna offer the same wahe. My mouth has been drooling just looking at it. Mm, it's tender yet crispy. The pork belly is juicy with strong savory citron flavor and slightly spicy. Yeah. 
even put like Sichuan peppercorn <coughs> to stir fry the veggies. <laughs> Seventy-five. 